So the last QPR update is finally here. Most likely the last one. This is QPR 1 Beta 3, which I've installed on my device and based on Android 16, of course. We are talking about Android 16 in this case. Android 16, QPR 1, which brings you Material U Expressive. If you are a Pixel device user, if you have used Android 16, if you are using Android 16 stable version, this is the final update which you are getting most likely next month. Not so sure, but most likely. With this new update, we do not have major changes, but few tweaks are there. For example, the settings UI have minor differences, minor tweaks. The space between these options has been reduced actually. Not a major difference as I just told you, but it is here. Secondly, you will notice on the lock screen, we have colorful weather icon available in this case. Another minor change, but it is included. So just wanted to let you know. By the way, this was a part of Android Canary also. You can check out more about Android Canary. The video is available in the I button. If you move on to some other options, you will see the volume panel is already themed. And those were some basic changes which were available with the latest QPR1 Beta 3. But now we have, because this is the last update of QPR1. So this will come in the stable stage for all users in the next month, most likely. So the new quick settings panel is also here. The new volume panel, as I just told you, the quick settings panel also have the themed icons, basically blur enabled. You can resize the tiles, you can reposition them. And this is just so good. Many users were complaining about this one when Android 16 stable was released. Android 16 stable was good, but that was almost similar to Android 15. The major UI changes which many user people, many people were looking forward to was actually available with QPR beta users. But now, because this is the QPR one's last update, so most likely we will see this thing in the stable update next month, most likely. The Pixel Launcher also have minor changes in this case already because if you did not follow the things in QPR one beta versions, then this video is for you because this is what you will see in the stable stage in the next month, most likely. The Pixel Launcher tweaks you just noticed also have the landscape mode available in the Pixel Launcher setting. Seems to be quite exciting one. You just notice a blur also available in the app drawer. In wallpapers and style UI, there is a major difference which is not present if you're using Android 16 stable version. In wallpapers and style UI, we have different sections for everything. The UI has been changed completely to adjust the layout. This is the new UI what we have. We have icons option, which we have themed options. And by the way, lock screen also have this clock customization available. Other clock styles are kind of really same, but the default clock can be customizable, which is good, which is not present if, for you, if you are using Android 16 stable. And of course, if you're using Android 15, this is not available for you. This new wallpapers and style UI looks quite good. Whenever you try to apply wallpaper, you'll see new UI and so on. Things are quite exciting in this case, and that might be very useful for many people if you love these kind of UI things. Also, the lock screen shortcuts have this new UI available in this case. So almost everywhere you will see new UI, which seems to be quite exciting one. Settings UI, as I just told you, settings UI also has been changed. If you are using Android 16 stable, you will see a major difference because settings UI is now colorful one. The progress bar, these bars everywhere, we have this new UI available, new kind of sliders available everywhere. The switches have been changed and many more things. As I just told you, if you are already following up the QPR1 status, then this thing might not be new for you. But if you are into Android 16 stable, looking forward to a major update, then this is for you because this is coming very soon and I'll cover that for sure. Mods option is already there and new storage progress bar, you can say. This slider is also has been now changed to the expressive UI. Many things have been changed, many things were improved, some bugs were there, many things were fixed. So there was a testing phase with Android 15, Android 16's QPR1, which has now been completed as far as I know, because this is beta 3. Most likely you will not see beta 4 and you will see stable version, but no one knows. If you see beta 4, we might see that I'll, I'll make a video on that one too. Advanced protection has been enabled actually in this case. It was in the previous version too. So I guess uh, you love that thing too. Advanced protection has more options uh, related to device security. If you are a custom room user, because many users on my channel are from custom room. So this might not be useful for you because you do some things. So advanced protection is not for you. Everything else is just quite similar. This is what we have. This is about the quick follow up, uh, follow up regarding Android 16, which is now, which is the stable version coming very, very soon. This is it. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.